At a gas station called Clark's Pump and Shop, we spent $10 and 76 cents. Uh, we reviewed a lot of Uncle Ray's, so I was thrilled to death. I found three more. Uh, this is Uncle Ray's Hot Cheese Crunch. And they look like Cheetos, but like hot Cheetos. And then this is Jalapeno Ranch. And then these are the onion rings. And then right when we went in the door, Kevin spotted these. These are Michelle's Bakery, and this is a peanut butter no-bake cookie, a chocolate no-bake cookie, and a fudge brownie. And then at Cracker Barrel, we spend a lot of money at Cracker Barrel. Cracker Barrel, if you don't know, is one of the most expensive places to shop. I mean, I think they're even more expensive to shop than World Market. They're very, very expensive. It, we spent $72.41 on just this little bit right here, $72.41. Uh, we bought the Palmer Candy Milk Chocolate Covered Peanut Butter Pretzels and the Palmer Candy S'mores Snack Mix. In case you don't know, there are two Palmer Chocolate Companies, Palmer Candy, so uh, this is might not be the same as what you're thinking. And then uh, Amos, Amos uh, had just sent us some little um, orange gummies, and they were actually shaped like little oranges, and I asked you all, I said, hey, where do they sell those? Well, they had some at Cracker Barrel. They had the 4D Gummy Dinosaurs, and then these are called Cocktail. So I'm assuming they'll have um, different flavors in here, and we'll have to find out and talk about them when we do the review, but those sound a neat. Then we bought some, uh, this is uh, Quality Candies Sweets All-American Taffy, and it's actually flavored taffy. So you get cherry, vanilla, and blueberry. And then that was Patriotic. And then this is Dosher's Candy Company Patriotic Pillows, and these are cherry, lime, and blue raspberry. I thought those would be fun. And then Kevin spotted these, Whirly Pop Gummies. They have cherry, orange, apple, and grape. Never seen those around here before. Little Peanut Monster, Chocolate Peanut Butter Nuts, and those are creamy, never seen those. And then Edward Mark Toffee Almonds in Milk Chocolate. And then we've never reviewed Cream Savers for the channel, so these are Orange and Cream and Strawberries and Cream. These went away for a long time and they're just now coming back. They also had those in big bags. And then the Cracker Barrel Salty Peanut Log. We've never reviewed that before, and it looks good. And then we bought a bunch of drinks to review. So, you may do the front or the back. The back, which one? You okay, pick. I'll do the front. This is Kist, K-I-S-T, Cotton Candy. This is, I just showed you the Whirly Pop Gummies. This is a Whirly Pop Soda. So, this is Sweet Strawberry, and this is Rainbow Fruit Punch. And then this is the Oso oh Key Lime from Oso oh Good. And then we have a Jones Cane Sugar Soda Watermelon. And then this is a Pearson, a Pearson Root Beer. And then we have a Premium Butterscotch Beer. And then we've tried Dad's Root Beer, but this is Dad's Orange Cream Soda, Blue Cream Soda, and Red Cream Soda. And then we've tried some stuff from Sioux City, too. This is a Sioux City cream soda, and Sioux City sarsaparilla. At Save-A-Lot, we spent $79.54. Uh, we bought these uh, frosty, uh, these are all uh, lemonade. So we have watermelon lemonade, strawberry, just the classic, blue and pink. And then we've had the Boyer, like the Mallow Cups, but we've never had these, I, or at least I don't remember. I'm going to look them up to make sure. But we've never had the Jimmy Sticks, as far as I remember. They're milk chocolate peanut butter cover, covered pretzel sticks. And then I've been looking all over for these Kellogg's Eggo Fruit Loops waffles, so I finally get to try those. The rest of the stuff I'm going to show you is all going to be on Kevin's Lunchtime Review channel. So Kevin was getting really low on freezer meals and so we went to save a lot and we bought a lot of different brands uh for him to try on that channel so this is the menu de sol and these are chicken taquitos and then we have beef taquitos and then this mantilla mantilla signature we bought the macaroni and cheese with bacon and we bought the lasagna with meat sauce all of these are microwavable meals just like kevin does on that channel 
These are all Easton's brand. So we bought a cheeseburger, a chicken pot pie, ham and cheese stuffed sandwiches, bacon Angus cheeseburger, pepperoni pizza, and barbecue rib sandwich. And then uh, pick five. So there's these are pick five, but then these are also pick five. Um, I don't know what the difference is. Uh, oh, these are pick five signature. Okay, so this is the, uh, these are the corn dogs. These are cheeseburger sliders, croissant with uh, sausage, egg, and cheese, and biscuit with sausage, egg, and cheese. And then these are the pick five signature. So you get uh, cheeseburger sliders, buffalo chicken sliders, chicken sliders, and supreme pizzas, which I don't know how that's gonna work, but it actually says there's four pizzas in there, and you don't have to like assemble them or anything, but that's an awfully small box, so they must be small. And then lastly, uh, we bought a Swanson chicken pie. At Walmart, we had not reviewed this Clear America Peach Nectarine, so we got that. And then we got two other Clear Americans. We got the Strawberry Punch Snow Cone and the Blue Raspberry. Uh, we got the Mountain Dew uh, Zero Sugar Baja Blast, um, a loaf of bread, the Heiner's 35 calorie bread, and some uh, sweetener for our coffee. And then we stopped at Grater's. Grater's has a flavor called Midnight Snack. And so we bought that one, but then we saw another one we've never reviewed before. This is the Banana Chocolate Chip, which sounds wonderful. At Vitamin Shop, uh, we bought... The, some rise drinks. Uh, this one is Sunny D. This one is Smarties, which I think is really cool. This one is Tiger's Blood. And then I'm trying to show you all the brands, the same brand at one time. Um, oh, here's the other one. This is Baja Burst. So there's four of those. And then there's a bang. This is Star Blast. And then this one is Strawberry Blast. This one is Miami Cola. And then we have two Ghost Energies. This one is Bubblicious. It's the Strawberry Splash. And then this one is Orange Cream. So excited about all those. And then at Meyer, these are Coles. Uh, they're, this is a new caramel filled breadsticks and chocolate filled breadsticks. They do have like mozzarella cheese too, which we haven't tried, but these said new, so I thought, oh, those will be really fun to try. And then also at Meyer, um, a Meyer brand, uh, it, this is Frederick's. It's the same that Frederick's by Meyer. So they have probably eight or ten different candy bars. I chose six. This is the sea salt caramel with dark chocolate. Blood Orange Flavored Caramel Dark Chocolate, Strawberry Truffle and Dark Chocolate, Happy Birthday Truffle and Milk Chocolate, Waffle Cone and Milk Chocolate, and the Sea Salt Caramel in Milk Chocolate. Um, I also got these Quest uh, Protein Chips there. Uh, this is the Nacho Cheese and this is the Ranch. We have reviewed those before. I'll show you why we bought them in a minute. You'll see. Um, these, I think this is awesome. So I've seen Catalina Crunch, uh, cereals in many places, Whole Foods, other places, but these are actually one serving pouches. So I love this idea. Uh, this is the chocolate peanut butter, cinnamon toast, dark chocolate, and fruity cereal. So we'll get to try all four of those. And they were $2 a piece in case you're wondering. But to me, it's worth spending $2 a piece before I buy a whole box of something. And then somebody called it to my attention that we've never tried the Ben and Jerry's Coffee Toffee Bar Crunch. So we picked that up at Meijer. Uh, we bought the new Pop-Tarts Snickerdoodle flavor and we bought some creamer for our coffee. I found the LOL Surprise. I love that box. I love LOL dolls. So that is cereal. It's birthday cake flavor. And then more Frederick's brand. These are limited edition. So we've done two reviews of Frederick's brand stuff like this. Uh, this is the Key Lime Cordials. These are lemon shortbread bites. These are s'mores bites. And then these are white and milk chocolate fruit mix. So there's different things in there. And then I bought two cans of hairspray. They do not sell the 
Uh, it's number four, but it has the pink band. I really like the smell of it. I do not think it holds as well. I'll just go ahead and tell you here. It does not hold as well as the gold band number four, but I just like the smell so much that I'll, I'll keep getting that. Um, at Target, we bought some favorite day uh, cookies. We bought the white chocolate chip with macadamia nuts, the s'mores, and lemon white chocolate chip cookie bites. They also had like chocolate chip cookies. They kind of looked plain. That's why I wanted to get those. Uh, we bought the milk chocolate peanut butter covered almonds, the lemon flavored yogurt dipped almonds, and the milk chocolate covered peanuts. Uh, Kevin loves trying stuff like this. This is the Good and Gather, which is a Target brand. Um, oven baked Parmesan cheese crisps. Um, this is Parmesan with everything. And then this is Parmesan with onion and sour cream. And then finally, I've been looking for these for a couple weeks now. These are the Favorite Day brand uh, mint and cream fudge flavored filled cookies and peanut butter and jelly filled cookies. And then at, uh, also at Target, we found three cereals. Uh, we found the Strong Berry. They only had um, the woman. They didn't have um, Superman. They only had Superwoman. I guess that's what her or name Supergirl. is. Supergirl. Oh, Supergirl. Oh, Superman's on the other side. Oh, well, I'll be darned. There he is. Okay, well, they did have him then. Okay, well, all the, <laughs> these were the ones that we saw. Okay, so, okay, he's on there. I just realized that once you pick it up. Yeah. Out, so. Okay, and then we bought the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes Cinnamon French Toast, because we've already reviewed the new Strawberry Milkshake one. And then we found the uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch Rolls, which I'm excited to try. And then uh, the at the Fresh Market, we bought uh, the Safe and Fair Company. I love this brand, it's really good. Uh, this is the Chesapeake Bay Season Popcorn, and then we bought the Dill Pickle Season Popcorn. And then I bought nine. These are very expensive, by the way. These are like $8 a piece. Uh, Stonewall Kitchen Peach Amaretto Jam. And I bought nine of them because that's all they had out on the shelf. Um, and then Kevin wanted to try. We've tried some of these. Uh, Dulcelza. Dul Dulceza. We've tried several of these um, before, but not this, uh, not this one. This is the... Tramontana, and it has, I think it has uh, Dulce de Leche, dark chocolate, so it has a lot going on. And then this one is the Peanut Butter Mash. So I didn't read the side of it in the store, but I can only assume that, I'm assuming it's going to have banana because it says mash. And then at Trader Joe's, we bought the uh, Ube Tea Cookies, Purple Yam Shortbread Cookies. We bought some fancy cheese crunchies. Kevin's going to be reviewing these on his Lunchtime Review channel. This is a Philly Cheese Bayo Buns. This is a pork shumi, pork dumplings, and these are the chicken. And then we bought some uh, fig cookies. And then I bought some ice cream. I got the strawberry. This is non-dairy oat. Um, and then this one is a wild cheesecake ice cream. And then this one is the peanuts for chocolate ice cream. We also got a strawberry swirl cheesecake. Um, I bought this oat chocolate bars. And then I bought uh, four of their candy bars. So this is, uh, they're all organic. This is milk chocolate truffle, dark chocolate bar, dark chocolate bar with almonds, and dark chocolate truffle bar. And then we bought the Aussie style chocolate cream sandwich cookies, which is basically a Tim Tam, but it's Trader Joe's. And then we bought the cashew butter cashews, the peanut butter caramel coated popcorn, the sour cream and onion rings. These are lentil and rice snacks. Onion chips, we figured those would be fun to try. Crispy onion chips. And then we bought the peanuts and a pickle uh, dill flavored uh, Virginia peanuts and then uh, the crispy Thai chilies and sesame seeds and then at Kroger uh, we bought the Julian's recipe these are Belgian pastry waffles this is the Belgian chocolate and then this is the sweet vanilla 
And then Kevin's going to be trying these on his Lunchtime Review channel. These are the Brazzy Bites. This is double egg and cheddar. They are going to have another flavor, though. They just hadn't put it out on the shelf yet. The other one is, I think, either bacon or sausage. Uh, but it's, it's a sandwich. And then the Frontera, these are uh, burrito bowls. So we have the pork carnitas. We have carne asada and chicken verde. And then Boston Market has some new meals out. This is the uh, chicken bacon ranch. This is Vermont white cheddar mac and cheese. And this is hot honey fried chicken. And then we bought the Mountain Dew. Uh, this is... What is this called? Baja Mango Jam. And that's why we bought the Baja Blast, Baja Blast at the very, very beginning of this haul. Um, and then this is the Baja Gold. And then we bought, the reason you saw the Quest chips is because Atkins has come out with their new chips. So we're going to compare them and see how they compare. This is Atkins protein, protein Chips. These are the Nacho Cheese. And then these are the Ranch. And then we bought a mixed box of Cool Ranch Doritos and Nacho Cheese Doritos. At Kroger, we got some Cheetos. These are 10 individual bags of Cheetos. I bought some Lance Toasty Peanut Butter Crackers. And then uh, I figured we would review these. These are Fannie Mae Peanut Butter Pretzels and S'mores. And they're in milk chocolate. Both of them are. And then Kevin wanted uh, a little snack. And so... Um, uh, these are gobstoppers, and you can have nine of these for only 60 calories, and they will last you a long time. And then at Walmart, we bought two packages of Johnsonville beef brats, some Q-tips, uh, some Glad, uh, uh, Glad uh, bags. Garbage. Yeah, they're garbage bags with gain and Febreze. Some quilted northern toilet paper. And then we bought the new... Um, uh, scorching. These are Pringle Scorching. They're a limited time only. First we feast the hot ones. So you may have seen our review when they did the chicken. So these are the Pringles. These are the Los Calientes Verde and the Rojo.